Here's another story about a pet. What kind of a pet do you think this is? It's a cat whose name is Max. And in this story, Max attacks. By Kathy Appelt. Appelt. This is Max. He attacks. In a bowl of water brimming with fishes, lots of fishes swimming. Max's paws are made for pounces. Max's legs are made for trounces. Like a dozen kitty wishes, midst the bubbles swish the fishes. Oh oh. Oh oh. But, hold on. Something's happening. He's full of gusto, full of steam. He charges up the window screen and clings and clings and clings some more. Then, score! Max one dog none. Deep inside their indoor ocean, fishes swim in fishy motion. Our kitty boy is on the hunt. He heads towards the ocean front. Pink and red and orange too. Max is thinking fishy stew. Max's nose is twitchy, twitchy. Max's tail is switchy, switchy. Hey, oh, what's this? He licks his chops. He's been deterred. Is that his favorite catnip bird? He grabs it with his catcher claws, tosses it between his paws. Up, 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 ahoy, uh-oh. Where did that catnip birdie go? A basket filled with dirty socks. Oh, happy days. This basket rocks. He better snag them one by one. He bites them all, and when he's done, he flicks his ears, he gives a scratch. It's clearly not an even match. Socks none, max ninety one. Fishes, fishes, swirls and swishes, wishes served on kitty dishes. Switchy, switchy, twitchy, twitchy, he crouches low.
Then, whoa, something bobs beneath the table. Can he snag it? Is he able? It's a thing, a dangling thingy. No, a string, a string by jingy. That stringy swings from someone's shoe. Attack! Now Max is swinging to a roo. What else? What else can one cat do? Bubble, bubble, twitchy, twitchy, trouble, trouble, switchy, switchy. Our sneaky boy is on the creep. He peers into the ocean deep. Back and forth those fishes go, swishy, swishy, to and fro. He perches on that bowl of water lower, 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 teeter, totter. Splash! Max's fur is sleek and clean. He dries it in a sunny beam. He meant to wash it anyway. He'll catch those fish another day. His tummy growls, he's got the munchies. There it is, his bowl of crunchies. Attack! No catnip, no fish, just dinner. Our kitty boy is tuckered out. A big old yawn escapes his mouth. He curls up on his cozy rug and gives his trusty tail a hug. He's done, kaput, stopped in his tracks. A mighty nap attacks our Max. Fish is orange, pink, and red, snoozy in their watery bed. Max Nun Fish 6 plus 1. This is Max. He attacks. The end. So Max didn't get very far, did he? Whoop. Max attacked, didn't get the fish, but you have to be careful. You never know. You have to be so careful with fish and a cat. I envy people that have lots of pets, though. Lots of work. Bye for now.